Could this small flower hold genetic clues for more drought-tolerant crops? That's exactly what researchers at Andres Bello University in Chile are exploring. The fact that a plant can grow in these conditions is quite remarkable. The Cisante longiscapa, locally known as Pata de Guanaco, blooms during rare rainfall in the dry Atacama Desert. The phenomenon caught the attention of Ario Orellana, director of the Plant Biology Center at the university. The Atacama Desert is the driest in the world and also one of the territories with the highest solar radiation and ultraviolet radiation on the planet. This means there are very adverse conditions for the growth of any living being. This flower has adapted to survive water scarcity and extreme temperatures. Now, researchers are studying it to uncover the secrets behind its resilience. The team is sequencing its genome with the aim of transferring drought-tolerant traits to other crops. By understanding the genome, the genetic information of this plant, and at the same time identifying which genes are expressed when it is exposed to drought, we could potentially use that knowledge to develop crops with greater drought tolerance. Chile faces growing water challenges. The World Resources Institute ranks it among the most water-stressed countries, and projections suggest severe drought across the fertile Central Valley by 2050.